Hey guys, I know it's been a very long time since I've been back on YouTube, but um, I just wanted to come on here and talk to you guys and give you guys yet another must needed update you guys i have not been on youtube for some months now and i really do want to get back into it so i decided to kick off me getting back into youtube with a life update video i want to catch you guys up on some things that y'all have missed and yeah i just want to start it off with no secrets i don't have anything i'm hiding from you guys after this video disclaimer y'all um i'm doing my skincare right now so i have on some patches and i am just chilling right now i just got out the shower after day at work so now i'm just ready to relax and update you guys i have some things that i want to talk about but if you guys want to hear my life update then keep watching all right so firstly i just wanted to touch base on the last time that we talked the last time that we talked my life was very different that was before a lot of things happened and i was definitely a different person a few months ago i'm definitely much better i'm in a much better place than i was then i am trying to improve more on my life and do more and that was just the start of it so now i definitely have went through some things that have got me to the place that I am now. So the first thing I'm gonna update you guys on is school and my home life. So with school, as y'all know, I am a senior in high school and I will be graduating this year. I'm super excited to graduate. An update with school, if you haven't watched my last update video, I was completing college courses, doing dual enrollment in order to get some free college credit. But now I have decided that I'm not going to college. So I, that dual enrollment credit I will not be using. As of now, I've just decided that I'm not built to go to school, go to college at least. I'm just ready to live my life, you know, without being stuck with the pressures of having to go through school. So I am gonna take a break. I might not ever go back to school, but we'll see. As of now, I've decided no. And then my home life has been pretty okay. I've just been not, I haven't, if I'm honest, I haven't been home very much. I am always at work. And if you guys don't know, I do work at a cupcake shop. So I'm there pretty often. And then I just try to stay like in nature or something. You know, I try to keep myself busy because I, I my big thing for this year is to be productive. So if I'm not productive, then I feel, um, I don't know, I just feel off if, I'm, if I don't have something to do. And sometimes when I'm at home, I can sometimes feel like I'm not being productive. Something else to add on though to the home life is um, moving on. I will be, like even though I'm not going to college, I will still be staying at home. I'm probably, I'm working on maybe moving out within the next two years, but we'll see what happens with that, you guys. I'm just praying about that. I'm not sure exactly what's gonna go on with that, but that's the update for my school and home life. Another update, you guys, which probably not many of you guys no, but I have a little sister and I honestly did not know I had a little sister until the beginning of last year. I did not know this whole time and she is 12 years old and we met um, for the first time on December 20th, 2022. So we met and it was great. Like we spent a good two weeks together and I will insert a picture of us here, but it was a great two weeks. I I was glad to meet her. We're definitely just alike. We look alike. We like the same stuff. And it was a pretty fun two weeks. Another thing that also I should update y'all on is I did get into a car accident with my Mini Cooper, y'all. Happened in November. The crazy part about it was it happened when I was going to go get my friend a birthday present. And as I was leaving the parking lot of the store, some man, he like ran a stop sign and hit my car. The car accident was such a scary experience though because it was a big truck. I will be doing an updated um, Mini Cooper tour because I have since then I have gotten my car fixed and I have changed some things I was so shocked to have gotten in that accident. That was my first accident by myself I've never experienced anything like that and that man was so crazy I, I'll give you guys a story time in an upcoming video about what happened with that I also wanted to give you guys some business updates so if you guys do not already know I run my own skincare business. It's called Simone skincare shop I sell all natural, vegan, and cruelty-free lip care, skin care, and body care products. Um, so if that interests you, make sure you guys go check out my website down below in the description. But some 
updates on that are I am planning on running my business full time. I'm wanting to do that instead of going to college. I want to take some of skincare shop much more seriously. I want to get an office space. There's some things that I want to do to keep this business afloat. I don't want to have to keep running it from my bedroom. So I'm just hoping to get the means to be able to do that. Um, I want to be able to expand and do more. Some of you guys may or may not know, but some of my products are manufactured, so I do not personally make the products. I want to have the means to be able to get everything manufactured. Sometimes just making it is on the cheaper side, but I want to be able to get things manufactured so that I can produce more at a time. So yeah, that's going to be something different that's going on. Um, but other than that, um, I'm really proud of my brand. So if you guys would like to go check that out, I would really appreciate you guys. I've really been working on it and this is something that I wanna pursue full time. This is something that I wanna be, I want this to be my career. So I would truly appreciate any support you guys. So thank you so much. All right, next I wanted to give you guys some of my life goals. I've named a few already, like I want my brand to expand. I wanna be able to live move out of the house at around in around two years or so some little small ones are i want to be more active i want to do things more with within nature i love going on walks and going on runs and yeah i just want to be out more in nature and doing more things that excite me um i feel like being in school this past year has just been such a routine and i don't like it like i do not like having to get up to, to go to school for somebody else. And it feels like I'm doing it for somebody else. Sometimes I don't feel like I'm going for me or doing things for me. I'm doing it for other people. I'm doing it for because so-and-so or, you know, and it just frustrates me. So I wanna do more things that interest me. Um, I wanna go outside and do things. I like to be alone. So um, if I can go outside and be by myself, I like to do that. So I plan on being more active Another thing is eating more healthy. That's so hard to eat healthy sometimes because first of all, it's seeming like grocery shopping is about the same price as eating out nowadays. These prices are not, like I'm not responding to these prices well. So it's, it's kind of hard to eat healthy, which I never understood. Like why is it harder to eat healthier? Like, I don't know. It's like the expensive food or the cheaper food is the stuff that's bad for you, which I hate. Another thing with the eating healthy too is it helps your skin. As you can see, my skin is breaking out and that's because I have been eating unhealthy for a while now and I wanna get back into eating better. The food that I've been eating recently has just not been in. I've been eating out every day for like the past week and a half, literally every single day. Today was a cutoff though, I did not eat out today. So yeah, I just wanna get back into taking care of my skin, using more of my products and everything. So if you guys have any products or anything that you would recommend to me for dark spots, please leave those in the description. That's my main problem is dark spots. And I've tried like different bleaching creams, I've tried different spot correctors, and they just haven't worked for me as much. I mean, they do work sometimes, but then like, it seems like they come right back, I guess. Or they fade for a little while and then they just go back to normal color. I don't know why, but anybody could leave me any products, that would be great. I also wanted to give you guys a relationship update. For those of you guys that may or may not know, I do have a boyfriend. His name is Ray. I've been dating him for over a year now. Our one year was on January 4th, 2023, so today is the 28th february 28th so it's been a little over a year and our relationship has been great the whole time that we've been together it's been amazing i'm really happy to be with him i really have nothing bad or anything to say about that it's been good like how, how it's always been and i'm really appreciative of that so yeah and then the last thing i'm gonna update you guys on is friendship you guys may or may not have seen my last video or two videos ago, I think I did a video of me going out with my friend. That is no longer my friend. We don't have any bad blood, I don't think. It's just, we just, we have two different priorities in life and they're just different from each other. Yeah, I'm not gonna say too much about that besides I feel like I have much more mature priorities. Also with friendships, I do not have any. So that was the only one and it's like not even there. It's like not a thing anymore. So I really don't have any. Um, which is fine. I really doesn't, it really doesn't bother me. It would be nice. You know, sometimes it does get a little sad when, you know, you just want to have that friend. Like, I don't even want friends. Uh, I want a friend. 
that, you know, is down for anything and also would like to just chill, you know? I don't like friends I like to do too much, but I would also like a friend that I can do nothing with and not feel bored, you know? But um, it's kind of hard to find people around like that are like that. And that's okay with me. Like, I'm down to wait until I can find somebody like that. Like, I'm not rushing to get a friend. But it is nice because as of now, my boyfriend is like my, my best friend. So I usually just do things with him. But sometimes you just need some girl time. And I really don't have many people that I'm friends with. Like, and if, if I am friends with them, it's not like a close friendship. Like, we're just kind of cool. But yeah, I don't have any like close friends or my only, I do have a best friend. Her name is Yasmin, but we don't live together. Like we don't live together. I mean by we don't live in the same state. We live apart from each other. I live in Georgia. She lives in Texas. We've been friends for so long that we've been friends for 10 years. But I'm hoping to see her this year. That's another one of my life goals. We want to see each other this year. And since we're both graduating, we're praying that that happens. Friendships kind of non-existent right now which is fine i'm a pretty good friend though and i don't feel like i should just be friends with just anybody so that's my problem i think what's well, not really a problem it's more so like a a requirement of mine anyways guys i hope you guys enjoyed today's update thank you guys for watching i really appreciate you guys please leave down below some more video suggestions for me if you have any also be sure to follow all my social medias and shop my website if you would like to i truly appreciate you guys for watching and i can't wait to see you guys in my next video bye y'all